While hydrogen fuel cell cars are a practical reality, almost, a lot of work is still required, particularly when it comes to the safe transportation and also safe refueling of hydrogen-powered cars. With the aim of realizing a hydrogen-powered future, a group of automakers and other companies involved in hydrogen fuel cell-related industries founded this organization in order to further research efforts. The price of a hydrogen vehicle was as much as one million US dollars just a few years ago. But with recent cost reductions, it seems that hydrogen fuel cell vehicles priced under 100,000 US dollars may be only two to three years away. What remains to be seen, however, is progress in infrastructure. This company is one of the main suppliers of hydrogen in Japan. This setup represents their current design for a practical hydrogen filling station. It features a filling head that is decidedly larger than those found on gasoline pumps. Wow, pretty heavy. Since hydrogen gas can leak quite easily, robust precision engineered fittings are an absolute necessity. It would be nice if it was a bit lighter, but current regulations are quite strict. Hydrogen stations with pumps like these will most likely include underground storage. So, what's the company's vision for the development of hydrogen infrastructure? Kawasaki Heavy Industries exhibited this model of a tanker ship for liquid hydrogen. It should become a reality in about 10 to 15 years. The company is also working on plans to extract and liquefy hydrogen from coal in Australia for shipment to Japan. Technologies already in use for liquid natural gas transport have been incorporated into the vessel's design. Well, not only is this thing designed to carry hydrogen, it would actually be powered by it, which may well be the future for all large vessels. They're also developing specialized trucks that use high pressure storage tanks for overland transport to filling stations. This firm presented some prototype high-pressure cylinders for hydrogen storage. This model, made of carbon fiber, is designed for use as a fuel tank in a hydrogen-powered vehicle. It's actually made up of a thin aluminum lining that's wrapped in a thick carbon fiber shell. I'm guessing that they won't be very cheap. Wow, that's amazingly thick. You know, it's completely different from making a gasoline tank. These larger tanks are meant for use in tanker trucks. So, that was the latest in Smart Energy.